You guys, we are in a falling wedge, and on September 24th, we are going to be touching the $8,000 mark for Bitcoin. Guys, we're still in this wedge. On October 23rd, we're going to be touching 7200 US dollars. Mark my words, right here, we're going to be hitting the bottom of this wedge. Guys, on October 25th, we are going to be, two days after touching the bottom of the wedge, we are going to bust out of this wedge. We're going to gain over $1,000, and we're going to hit around eighty six to 8700 US dollars on 1025. What's going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel. The number one place for accurate prediction, future forecasting for the cryptocurrency price. Today we're going to be talking about cryptocurrency, Bitcoin's falling wedge that it still is falling into, Bitcoin's falling wedge. So first thing we're going to do uh, right now is we're going to take a look at Bitcoin uh, right here at the top of this falling wedge right here. Bitcoin's kind of struggling to find some uh support it's 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 finding support on the top of this wedge right here uh one thing you can keep one thing to keep in mind is the 200 ema we're above that ever since the 25th as predicted uh to the exact day on this channel the exact price and day nothing unusual here it's very common for us to make completely accurate predictions we're very uh our record is near 95% on this channel. I don't know of any other channel who is predicting this price as well as we are, but we're gonna go ahead and take a step further and we're gonna predict, we're not only, that's one thing, we're not only gonna look at previous predictions that we've gotten right, which is all of them, but we're also going to be looking in the future. Uh, and you might be saying that's kind of risky because you don't know if they're gonna come true. That's the thing we do. And we're gonna take a prediction here. We're gonna predict that Bitcoin stays within uh, about 10,700 and about 7,400 uh, within the next six hours. I, I, I'm going to go out on a limb here. I don't think within the next six hours, Bitcoin is going to really uh, get much out of this range, potentially, possibly. It's very possible that Bitcoin might not go much further out of this range. Um, the, in, in, in other words, it, it's very possible and likely that within the next six hours, Bitcoin stays within this range here, with the very top here and the very bottom here. It's very likely that Bitcoin stays within that range. Now, I want to do something I don't normally do. We're going to switch over to the weekly chart. We're going to take a look at this on the weekly chart. And I want to kind of throw out some predictions as well for this with Bitcoin. And uh, guys, make sure, you know, this is one of the first videos in, in uh, a day or two doing price. So if you guys want a different coin besides Bitcoin, make sure to leave it in the comments below. Uh, make sure to subscribe, hit like, everything like that. We do a ton of giveaways on this channel. Everything's great. We do a lot of stuff, always giving back to the community. And the number one thing is that we always have accurate uh, price predictions, more so than any other crypto channel. Uh, we have more accurate price predictions and YouTube channels than all of the channels. All right, so on the weekly here, I'm going to go out on a limb here. I'm going to say within the next 12 hours, guys, this is... Uh, this is a prediction. Within the next 12 hours, we're going to stay uh, somewhere between 11,500 uh, to about 6,600. So about this whole area right here, let me, uh, about this whole area right here, uh, we are going to most likely stay in this range. Uh, we're probably not going to bust out of this range within the next six hours. This is on the, within the next 12 hours, actually. Uh, this is within, this is on the weekly chart. So I think we're gonna probably, possibly, most likely stay in that range there. Um, another thing I wanna look at too, I wanna go to the four hour for this, cause this is really important here. This is something you really gotta pay attention to. So one of the things you notice is that Bitcoin went really high up and then it slowed down for a second, but then it went really high up. Uh, but then what you notice here is that the candle wicked, you know, seemed to find some resistance right around the 10,372 area, as predicted uh, over a month ago to the day. Um, and then it kind of found some support, went down a little bit, uh, found some resistance uh, right here around uh, a little under 10,000 actually, and then found some support, about 800, 600, 600, 800 dollars less, uh, right around 9,200, right at the top of this line here, uh, almost. So I think naturally we're going to probably have a pullback to at least this area right around 9,000 again. But interestingly enough, this is something I really want you guys to take a look at. Uh, right here one thing you notice is look at all this volume see how high this this volume is right here 
look at this candle right here. Right here is a very large candle. That's over 15. You know, that's 15. That's so high. And then if we look at some of our other indicators, we're going to look at the stochastic RSI. You can look, look just look how low this is. That's one of the things about crypto and uh, technical analysis is that we have something very low here, right? And then we have something very high just uh, about two days ago. Again, this is on the four hour. Now, if we want to switch to the daily, we can get a better picture of this. This daily candle is so big. The last time a daily candle was this big was actually about four months ago uh, to the day. It was actually June 26th, 626. And now 1026, October 26, exactly four months later, we have another massive candle. This is absolutely insane. Uh, you don't really see that stuff too often. But these candles are absolutely huge. Now, with that in mind, let's take a look back here. Where is the stochastic on 626? We can, we can open this up right here. The stochastic here, right on that 20 line. And the stochastic now is all the way up here on the daily. So those are kind of the things unexpected. You know, you never know what's going to happen with crypto. But one thing's for sure, you, we, we don't get everything right all the time. But it is, for the most part, about over a 95% accuracy on this channel. Uh, I don't like to brag. Uh, I am right very often. Um, my people and I are, are often very right. But yeah, I just wanted to throw that out there. Um, we predicted it. We got this right. And now, like I said, I did make a prediction earlier in the video. Uh, and again, I will re reiterate that for all the viewers, all the people tuning in. Uh, 11,600. 11,600. Excuse me. 11,600. All the way down to potentially 6,600. So not too big of a range um, right here. A pretty, pretty tight area that I'm predicting. In the next 12 hours, Bitcoin is going to be trading somewhere within this $4,000 gap, this $4,000 uh, area, I'm predicting Bitcoin will be staying in this $4,000 area. Uh, and that's going to be it for this video. Guys, make sure to tune in for the next one. Um, you know, we don't give financial advice on this channel, but we just analyze these markets, vape, you know, pay very close attention to them. Uh, and that's what's most exciting. If, if you guys are new, we, you know, welcome to the channel. Thanks for coming by. Thanks for subscribing, liking. Thanks so much for being part of this channel. Um, make sure to leave a comment about your next favorite crypto that you want to talk about in this next video. And I'll see you in the next crypto episode.